A little over 10 years ago, I was introduced to the lifestyle of minimalism. It was my neighbor who first introduced me to the word. As soon as she told me about minimalism and intentionally owning less stuff, I was in. Both me and my wife, we had two kids at the time, they were six and three, and we started going through our home owning less stuff. Over the course of about nine months, we got rid of 60 to 70% of our possessions because I loved owning less. The less I owned, the more I started to enjoy my life. Here are 12 reasons that I love minimalism, why I personally have enjoyed owning less stuff. Number one, it means more money for anything else I want to do with my life. If I'm buying less things, it means I have more money to do other stuff. Number two, Owning less means I had fewer chores to do. I love having a clean house, but I hate doing cleaning. And I have found that owning fewer things makes that possible in my life, which is great. Number three, I have more time available. I'm doing less cleaning and less shopping and less managing and maintaining and organizing and less taking care of things which means I have more free time available to do anything else that I want to do with my life. It's great, I love it. Number four, as I've started owning less stuff, I have begun becoming a better example for my kids. We get so upset when our kids want us to buy new things or they're envious of other kids at school and they constantly want more and more stuff. And yet I found that most of the time my kids were just learning that from me, that when there was something I wanted to buy, I would just rush out and buy it. And as I've purposely overcome consumerism in my life and purposefully decided to own fewer things, I think that's become a far better example for my kids. Number five, I have found that minimalism aligns with my faith. I don't talk a lot about my faith here on our YouTube channel, but I've been a pastor. I was a pastor for 15 years and my Christian faith has always been very important to me. I found that minimalism aligns my life with my faith, which is another reason that I love it. Number six, I have found that I compare myself less with other people. At least in terms of physical possessions, what they have compared to what I have, as I have become content with less and wanted to own less, I'm less inclined to compare myself with other people, what they're buying, what they're parking in their driveway, what they're wearing. It's nice to uh, not have to live my life constantly comparing myself to other people. Number seven, I have found that as I owned less stuff, I was able to own higher quality things, that being minimalist and being frugal aren't necessarily the same. Some people pursue minimalism out of frugality, but this isn't always the case. If I'm just gonna own a few pairs of pants rather than 10 to 20, it means I get to own a nicer quality pair of pants. Number eight, as I have begun owning fewer things, I have found more intentionality in life, that actually living a life of constantly bringing new things into the home, constantly filling up our house with stuff and needing more closet space or needing more organizing solutions, it's a pretty unintentional way to live. I don't think anyone sets out in life and says that their greatest goal is just to own as much clutter as possible. And so as I become more purposeful and intentional about the things I need to own in order to accomplish my goals in life, I found more intentionality in other spaces and in other areas of life as well. Number nine, I have found more opportunity to contribute to others. Seems to me we're either living our life for ourselves or we're living our life for other people. And as we spend less time and money and energy on our own selfish pursuits, we're able to live a more selfless life contributing to others. 
Number 10, I have found better relationships after finding minimalism. Owning less doesn't automatically make you a better friend or provide you with better relationships in life, but what owning less does is it provides margin to become a better friend to others. As I'm focused less on what I'm accumulating and more on what I can offer to others, you can't help but bring about better relationships into your life. Number 11, I'm a far more grateful person than I ever was before. As I focused less on the things that I didn't have and began to appreciate more the things that I already do, I found that I became more grateful and gratitude has all sorts of life benefits that comes about. I could go all day listing why I love minimalism and the benefits that have come from owning less, but maybe I'll just end with a 12th. And that is, I found better self-understanding. I learned a lot about myself through the process of owning less, what things I held on to, why I accumulated things I didn't need, why there were things that were hard for me to get rid of. I learned a lot about myself. My wife would say that she learned a lot about herself through this process as well. We've learned a lot together as a family. I love owning less. I love minimalism. I like minimalism. It's something I'm going to continue for the rest of my life. No doubt you will find benefits in your life as well. Thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, we'd love to have you give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like more videos like this, then consider subscribing to our channel.